friends on YouTube. Welcome to AM Soaps. Today I'm going to make my Love Spell Soap and I'm going to put on my safety glasses and my gloves. Although my gloves don't match, they're still effective. I have one left. I don't know how this happens because when you buy them you get an even number of gloves. But I have one left from two different packages. So anyway, I'm going to put on my gloves and then we'll check the temperature of my oils and my lye water. This is lye dissolved in, dissolved in distilled water. Temperature is 75.3 Fahrenheit. And this is my blend of vegetable oils, 78.2 degrees Fahrenheit. And room temperature, just so you know, 73.2 Fahrenheit. So I'm soaping at room temperature. Oh, put on my glasses. Look at me. But you saw the minute I touched my lye, I, I knew I was missing my protective equipment. So put in our live water. I'm going to be making two four pound batches at the same time. So just so you know, if you don't know the safe usage of your fragrance, Whoever sold it to you has to be able to tell you that. They should not be selling fragrances if they don't have that information. So you should contact them and ask them. Say, I bought this fragrance from you. What is the safe, IFRA, safe usage amount? That's the sentence you need to say. And if they can't tell you that, then they should not be selling that fragrance. I really like the company I buy from in Ontario I buy from the most because they print it here right on the label so I don't have to go back to uh, the website or um, do any more research it's right there on the label when I'm using it and it tells you soap perfume um, let me see it says soap body wash bath salts lotion scrubs face cream perfume lips says absolutely zero, do not ingest. So before we continue, I'm gonna to read to you the description of Love Spell the Fragrance. Love Spell is a Victoria's Secret fragrance. So this is a duplicate of that fragrance. It is described as a lavishly lush blend of orange, peach, cherry blossom, and white jasmine. And it has zero vanilla content. So that description, should explain my design, why I make my design the way I do. I just make a pretty pastel design. And I use four colors. Last year I used my, my mold with my partitions. This year I'm just gonna pour it in stripes. Um, in order for me to be able to do that design, I'm gonna have to let this thicken up uh, it will thicken up as I, I'm going to have to stick blend all these one more time after I add the colorants and that's going to thicken it up a little bit. And when we get the molds out here, it should be ready to go. I don't want my colors to be too deep and dark. Ooh, that's pretty. Alright, so I've let this sit for a few minutes. These have thickened up a bit. I think we're ready to pour now. I just don't want them to blend in the mold. I want them to stay separate colors. So I don't want them to be too thin. Here's my four pound loaf molds. And my goal is to kind of pour down the sides here and see if I can just keep these in segregated stripes, not together. We're not in a hurry at all because this fragrance does not speed up trays. I'm going to use this tape here to keep my mold on an angle. And there we go. I'm making two at the same time, so. Pour more of the purple. And then after this, it will get stripes, uh, swirls made with a chopstick. And 
and my color for hearts, hearts will go in. So I guess I'd classify this as a Valentine's Day soap. It will be nice and ready on Valentine's Day. This is the Violet Pearl Mica. It's thickened up a little bit. I just want to put it down the center. Pour it in this one. Whoop! A bit too much. That's why I was spooning it in the other one. Um, I have tons and tons and tons of hot pink yet to pour. So let's pour some hot pink. Love soap needs to heart embeds. So I'm gonna put a blue one in here. Oh, wait, 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 let's let's uh, swirl first with the chopstick. If we don't swirl first with the chopstick, then that heart's gonna be in the way. So I'm just gonna go up like this. And I switched my left hand and go the other way, counterclockwise with my left hand, and then do the same on this loaf. Clockwise. With my right hand, change to my left, counterclockwise with my left. And this, I believe, is going to look marbled. Hopefully we've got some pretty swirls going on in there. Now the heart. Blue heart in here. Just tap it down. And the batter just forms over top. I just like that. The pink one over here. Same thing, I just tap it with my finger and the batter forms in the voids. Purple one over here. Tap, tap, tap. Do, 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 do. And the yellow one over here. And a white one in here at the end of that in here. And I'm going to push it down a little bit deeper so they aren't at the same level in the soap. And a white one here again pushed it down deeper into the soap. So they're not at the same level, they're staggered.
still got hope After all these years I've still got faith Enough to get me there And I've still got love Down in my soul These three things They're gonna make me whole Yeah, I've still got breath and here I am again I've still got words to say the things I want to say and I've still got dreams. I'm back now to cut my love spell soap it smells really really good it looks pretty so far. Let's cut into it and see how it looks. This should be popular for Valentine's and it will be ready for Valentine's. If it isn't in my Etsy shop right now, it's going to be in my Etsy shop any day after I post this video. I also make Love Spell perfume and Love Spell bath bombs. So that would be a nice Valentine's package. Different hearts. Okay, so here's loaf number two. A little bit more of this lilac color in this loaf. Oh, that's a pretty one. I like that one. Different colored hearts. There's a blue heart in this one. This one, <laughs> I had to cut through a butterfly. Let's go okay. That's about it. They all look very similar. Oh, that's a pretty one. Let's look at them side by side. Yeah, how do they turn out here? There, that's a way to look at them. So I hope that you enjoyed watching me make my love spell soap. Have a good rest of the day today. And take care of yourself and all those around you. And I will see you in the next video. Okay, bye everybody.